think John Parardi was a very creative, imaginative, and rigorous scientist. I think rigor was a very important quality of John Parardi. He, all his work was high quality, and he would not accept anything that was mediocre or of low quality. When you see the pictures, they are beautiful. The work has clarified very important functions, cell functions, especially the way secretion takes place, secretion of proteins. He, he elucidated what is called the secretory pathway, but he has done many other things. The structure of mitochondria is the one point on which he, the um, transport of uh, proteins across cells, what uh, uh, he called uh, uh, transcytosis. Uh, and so he's, he's made many important contributions, and of course those contributions have led to uh, important medical applications because once you understand a function, you can understand better the dysfunction, the, the troubles that uh, occur. You know, he, he lived uh, till a very ripe old age, older than I am today, and uh, his brain worked very well for most of the time, but he had uh, major physical problems, he had uh, problems walking and so on, and especially what uh, the, the, the most tragic for Palladi, he became blind. He had a macular degeneration, which is a sort of blindness for which there is no cure and no no remedy. So, and so progressively, this man who lived with his eyes, who looked at all these beautiful pictures, could not see them anymore. And I think that was a. I still met him not so many years ago. We had lunch in San Diego with uh, his wife, uh, Marilyn Fagua, who was still very active. And uh, uh, he was in good shape, but becoming, becoming very uh, blind. And I think that has been very uh, tragic for him. But he was a great man and a great friend. I, uh, I will always remember, remember him.